all along the Route 1 corridor from Hyattsville through North Brentwood, Brentwood and Mount Rainier to the district line lies the Gateway Arts District with many resident artists, their studios and galleries, most of which will be open for the annual open studio tour. It all happens tomorrow, and we met with coordinators Paul Houtenay and Anne LeCure at the Gateway Arts Exchange in Brentwood. So tomorrow, Saturday, May 9th, we have a studio tour along the Route 1 corridor, which is also known as the Gateway Arts District. And from 12 to 5 p.m., you can stop by 24 different venues where you have seven art openings and over 100 artists working in their respective studios. And you can see everything from glass blowing demonstrations over DC Glassworks to very powerful exhibitions over at the Prince George's County African American Museum and Cultural Center, as well well as a number of artist studios in Mount Rainier, um, including the Washington Glass School, which is very well known, Otis Street Art Projects, which is brand new, uh, Joe Hicks Ceramics, and White Point Studio, to name just a handful of the many stops that are in Mount Rainier and along the corridor. Do you recommend starting a particular place, like here? I actually, what I would recommend is you come over here. We're in the Gateway Arts Center right now. From 5 to 8 p.m., there will be an after party over here. Um, what I recommend is that you go to places like Hyattsville, like DC Glassworks, Renaissance Square, or um, uh, Alan Binstock's uh, studios, which are in Mount Rainier, they're in the residential neighborhood, and then work your way back over here to the Gateway Arts Center at about 5 p.m. Artists will actually be working um, in some places, like I mentioned, DC Glassworks, they'll be blowing glass. In other places, they'll be doing different ceramics demonstrations. Uh, but this is an opportunity for artists to interact with the public and for the public to ask questions of the artists. It's, it's a wonderful tour. It's the biggest visual arts event in the area. So it, it's just, it's, it's a great, great time. Anne, what's your part in all this? I'm part of um, Art Lives Here, which is the regional visibility campaign for the Gateway Arts District. We've been working on the Arts District for about 15 years now, and Art Lives Here has been around for three years. And we're trying to highlight all of the creative activity that happens in the Arts District. Um, and put a particular focus on um, the way artists act as small businesses mm -hmm. and how we can grow the creative industries in Prince George's County. So pick up the map showing 23 places to visit studios, watch more than 100 artists working, and enjoy a myriad of exhibitions. Cap it off with the after party at Gateway Arts Exchange from 5 to 8 at 3901 Rhode Island Avenue.